Welcome to our fourth programming exploration. Today, we're tackling an intriguing question from a developer who's diving into the world of fourth interpreters. They want to disassemble some of the generic fourth code words like plus, minus, and multiply using the C command in GFourth. However, they're running into a frustrating issue when trying to disassemble these code words, receiving an error that locks them out of their terminal. Let's unpack this challenge and see if we can find a solution together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today I'll be going through your questions, answering them and hopefully finding that solution that you're looking for. Guys, remember to say just a little bit crazy just like me and hopefully get to that resolution you need. Now, let's get started. Let's start by understanding the issue you're facing with the GFourth interpreter. You want to disassemble fourth code words like plus and minus using the command C. When you use C with your own colon definitions, it works perfectly. However, using it with built-in words like plus or division results in an error. The error message you receive indicates that these words are implemented in a way that doesn't allow disassembly. This is common for built-in operations in fourth. To resolve this, you can check the GFourth manual for alternative methods or explore the source code of GFourth to understand how these words are defined. If you still encounter issues, consider reaching out to the GFourth community for support. They may have encountered similar problems and can offer solutions. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Most versions of the SCE command in fourth are designed to decompile colon definitions. However, arithmetic operations like plus and divide are typically written in assembly code, which SCE cannot interpret. This is why you encountered a code error. To explore the inner workings of these operations, you can use the dump command to list the bytes and either disassemble them manually or use an external disassembler. Alternatively, you might find the source code for your specific fourth implementation. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. The word C in fourth is used to display the code of a word, but its behavior can vary. If you define the word yourself, you'll likely see the original code. However, for built-in words, especially simple ones like plus, the output may differ due to optimization or compilation. In GFourth, if displaying the code becomes complex, it uses system tools to analyze object files. You might need to install tools like GDB for deeper analysis. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. The user explains that the SE command in fourth works as intended. It shows disassembled machine code for words defined as primitives or through user-defined assembler code. When using CE, if you encounter a word defined in machine code, it won't show a code error. Instead, it will display the disassembled mnemonics.
For example, a user-defined word can be created using assembler mnemonics, which SEE will then disassemble. And that's it guys. I hope the video has helped find that resolution that you're looking for. And if it did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Now, until the next time you need a technical video, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.